Okay. <clears throat> this song is called Just Getting This Off My Chest. Okay, so after a year and a half of marriage, my wife and I start having problems. We were working, our two hours, the kids started to get reckless. So I told my wife if she wanted to go, to go ahead and take the kids home and I would stay with my family. She left and after a few hours the funeral home closed and I was going to head home. She asked me to stay there at my parents for a little while longer Due to her having a study class with some classmates that I don't like Well I stayed there for about 30 minutes Then called her back like she said And when I called her back she said to stay for an hour and then hung up I knew something wasn't right To our road, I pulled off to the side and walked to the house. While I was walking up, the classmates were leaving my house. So I kept on walking up the road. When I finally reached my house, I bought a new trailer in the beginning of the year. And by this time it hadn't been set up too long So there was fresh dirt everywhere I saw fresh tire tracks going behind the house Knowing that I or nobody else had pulled back there Due to the ground being too wet I walked behind the house to see somebody's car that I didn't know at first But quickly figured out So I softly walked up the stairs to the porch And heard some voices on the inside I put my key slowly and as I turned my key in the door My wife quickly ran to the door and tried to block me from coming in But by that point I had already seen who the person was Which was her ex that she had been talking to behind my back But they had a child together before we met But he had nothing to do with since he was born Anyway, I picked my skinny dressed wife up and out of the way To get her ex out of my house Ran to the back of my house my closet. After a few minutes and the sound of a pump shotgun, he came out telling me that he came over to talk about his son. Now remember, it is 11 at night. I call bullshit. I walked him out and after he left me and the wife got into an argument. To the back so we could try and not to wake the kids that were sleeping after a while We worked some things out and the next day we went to the funeral After the funeral we went out and had a good time That wasn't a fucking chord I just played
Well, fast forward, some things didn't work out. She got the house. I got put out the door, no place to stay. Paid all the bills and her phone bill for six months along with paying mine. Having no money left for anything. Skip ahead to November and I get word that she is prego by her ex. Well, that's fine and dandy, but the divorce ain't final. And after some checking, there's nothing I can do to try to get full custody of my daughter. But if I did the same, I would lose everything in my daughter. Skip ahead to the last month and she married her ex. And like I said, we're still not divorced. And yet again, there's nothing I can do about that. I'm getting screwed all the way around and I still have five months left. Like it says in the title. I just had to get this off my chest.